everyone, it's Teresa, and today I have a haul from Hobby Lobby to show you. They just, as of I think Sunday, as you're watching this, it is Wednesday, uh, they just marked down all of their spring and summer decor, toys, whatever it is, to 75% off. So if you have a Hobby Lobby nearby, I definitely recommend going and checking out the sale because there's quite a bit still, at least in my stores, they still had quite a bit. Now, the only thing is, is like some of the stuff I'm showing you today was from like a few days before they marked it down. So I bought it at 66% off instead of 75. So still a good deal, not as good of a deal, but it was actually a different store than my normal store that's near my house. So I probably wouldn't have found any of this stuff anyways. So that's what I'm gonna keep telling myself at least. So I'm gonna jump in and I am not gonna try and do too much math for you. I'll try to give you like a roundabout idea. I'm not going to look at my receipt or anything. Uh, so uh, like I said, a lot of this stuff was, it was kind of like half and half. Half of it I got at 66% off, half of it I got at 75. But almost everything I'm going to show you is in that sale group. <laughs> By the way, um, in case you're new here, there's this is only like my third video on this channel. My name is Teresa. I also have a DIY channel, Teresa B DIY. And this is my new channel, my home and hauls channel. I would love it if you guys would subscribe. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and comment below. It really helps. So first thing to show you is this gorgeous flower container. And it just says beautiful home flower for the pure and simple living. I'm not sure if I'm going to leave it like this. This original price was $10. So if you find it in your store, $2.50. I mean, how gorgeous. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. And I really liked it. So, and they had two. So I bought the two of them. I figured that that was a really good price. Um, I don't know if it's, it says it's for packaged or wrapped foods only. So I'm thinking I'm probably going to redo it with something for Christmas. Um, you'll have to wait and see. Maybe it's like Santa's Christmas cookies or Mrs. Claus's Christmas cookies. I have a couple ideas in mind and it'll be super cute and super easy just to flip it. And I mean, this is, this isn't a decal. It is painted on, so it won't be terribly hard to either paint over it or even just take like a little bit of sand paper to it or something. I think that'll come off reasonably easy enough. And if not, you just paint over it, right? And then it's already got like a lot of distressing already built into it. I mean, it's just beautiful. Love it. Then let's see. Okay, so this one, I bought it for $374. Original price was $15. I, like I said, I don't remember it which way I got it. I guess that that would probably be, I think that that's the price it was for 75% off. Again, I'm not doing quick math in my head. And it says just love, but I thought this would be so easy to paint over and do whatever I wanted with this shiplap look with the brown, a really easy thing to flip. You just tape off those edges so you can just paint over this. Couldn't be easier. Thought it'd be great for fall, be great for every day, anything, you know, <coughs> excuse me. This one original price was $15.99. I got it for $3.99. So I think I got this one before the 75% off went off. Sorry about that. I uh, had to pause the, the filming for a second. I was outside sanding down some stuff that I had painted and then sanding it off the paint to distress it. And I think I got a little, little powdery chalk paint in my throat. So anyways, so this one just says, what a lovely day. It's got these really pretty scalloped edges on them. And this, it's got the, the background is kind of a little textured. That's one thing I like about doing like the haul stuff from Hobby Lobby. That way, if you go online, because you can shop online for their clearance stuff. If you find things and you see, see it here, I'll let you know how the texture is. Some of the stuff they have is textured in a way that you'll see the writing. But this like, it's, it's got a texture, but it's not like, it's not bumpy where the wording or the designs are or anything like that. So you could definitely get away with painting this as well. I mean, a lot of this stuff is gorgeous as it is for home decor, but if you are someone who likes to flip things or like to DIY things, you're a crafter, these are a lot of really good options. One thing I love is they've all got the hardware form. You don't have to do it yourself. Put it in the wrong spot, not put one on that's big enough. You get the gist of it. 
All right, this one was originally $12.99. I know I got this one at 75% off. I had seen it online and I was like, well, I don't know. It might have a weird texture, but I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tape it off because this is so pretty. And I was like, you know what? If you tape that off and you do something like more neutral right here with like a word like blessed or home or whatever, it'd be super cute. I mean, it's really nice as it is again. Uh, it's no use to going back to yesterday because I was a different person then. So true, but not my thing as much. So I think I'm going to flip this one. So much good stuff. All right. So this one is metal. Original price was $14.99. So that puts it at what, like $3.75, four bucks, something in there. So bloom with grace. Again, cute as it is. This one is metal though, so it's a little different. If you hear screaming children in the background, please just ignore them. They're excited. They had their first day of school today and they were watching cartoons and apparently they're not anymore. <laughs> so again, this one, it'll be nice to flip. Super easy to paint over that. Sandpaper, whatever you wanna do with that, that'll just come up. I even might like do like a black just in here cause it'll cover this so much easier. And I'll be honest, this has a little bit of texture to it. So be warned if you see this one online, this one definitely has a bit of a texture. If you take some sandpaper to it though, it'll be like, you know, it'll, it'll definitely wear it away. Or you can use some kind of texturized paint. Like just for example, I might even do this. We'll see. This is the new, um, I didn't buy this today. This is the new terracotta paint from folk art. And it gives all your stuff like a terracotta look like, a, like a clay terracotta pot. It gives it the same look like it, like that. And I might try to use something like that cause it already has that texture built into it. It really is going to help like hide and disguise stuff. Those are not inexpensive paint by any means. I did get about six of them. I, I, if you can count up there a little bit, I'll move the camera. As you see, I have more than six. I bought some of them on my, by myself, or not by myself, but you know what I mean. I bought some of them as well. So, cause mostly cause I couldn't wait for them. I was impatient and I wanted them that way. I wanted them fast. All right. This one, original price, uh, it didn't have a tag. So they looked it up or made something up. I don't know. Original price, $5.99. I got it for like, what, a buck fifty on their sale? It just says, be you, not them. I mean, this sucker's a little beat up. I don't know that that's all on purpose, but I was just thinking like, you know what? This is going to get made over anyways. So what does it matter if it's a little bit beat up? The other day I was there um, before the 75% off went in effect and they had this like cutting board thing that obviously looked like it had something built in underneath it, but it was broken. And I'm guessing it had like a basket. That's what kind of made the most sense and what I think I've seen before. And they had it in like the 66% off and had it marked down to that and everything. And I was like, oh, well, it's it's broken. It's in the spring section, it's broken. They didn't want to do anything better for me. So I was like, fine, I'm not buying it. Um, I was like, I'll be fine to do it. You know, I'm thinking like, if you mark it down to like 90% off, I'd buy it even though it was broken. But they said no. So I said, no, thank you. Uh, um, this one just says stay a while. I actually had bought this a few shopping trips back when it was six, again, 66% off, but this time I got it at 75 and original price on this one was $10. So 250 is quite nice for that. And I think it's just probably just like the MDF. I'm trying to see. Yep. They do tell you on their stickers that it's just an MDF, but it's really nice. It's really pretty. It's not textured. I'm trying to think if there's a little bit. It's like a wood. It's a, it's a faux, obviously it's faux wood, but it kind of has like a little bit of that wood grain in there. If you can kind of see it, it's probably not coming up as well there. You can kind of see it at the top part. So I liked that. I, I have one already, but I thought, you know what, if I wanted to do, um, two different things that kind of work together, they need to be the same. You know what I mean? I think you do. <laughs> uh, on this one, I definitely got this one on the 75% off. It says, live like someone left the gate open and it's got a pig. Not a fan of that. This is pretty hefty. It's very similar to the ones you get from the Dollar Tree in that it's like a solid, uh, you know, block basically. Again, MDF, but they're very thick. Original price is $7.99. So I got this buddy here for what is that like two dollars and change again 
the math quickness. I used to be a lot better at it, now not as much. <laughs> and I'm saving all the big stuff for the end. I've got a few big things too. So this one, original price was $13.99. I got it for $3.49, so $3.50. It's just a really pretty butter dish. I probably should have looked at it a little bit because they have a little bit of scratching on it, but I'm leaving this one as it is. I'm gonna put it aside for my mom for birthday or Christmas. She has a December birthday, so it's one of those things I have to like start like putting things away aside for her. Now this one I got at 75, sorry, at 75% off. I'd seen it way back when it was full price and thought it was really cute then and thought, oh, I'll take a picture of it and probably make it for my dad. Original price is $21.99. Just bait your own hook, clean your own fish, tell your own lies. He'll like that for his deck. He's got a big um, back porch, big deck that he built. He's got like a built-in kitchen grill, two grills. Two girls? Two girls. No lie, he has like a toilet and sink out there <laughs> that he built all himself and everything. It's a really nice like back patio and he's got lots of kind of things like this. Um, I'll tell him, don't worry, I'll tell him I didn't make it. He, he likes it when I make him stuff too, but I'll tell him I didn't make it. But at 75% off, I was like, you know what? Uh, the way the wood is it's priced out right now, I'm not gonna be able to make it for that, so. I went ahead and picked that up. Uh, his birthday actually just passed, but I had already got him something for his birthday. So I was like, I'll just put it away for Christmas because he's really hard to buy for. I mean, he's very typical in that sense that he's hard to buy for. This was just in like their floral, like they're in their ribbon area, the ribbon slash wedding area. And it was half off, original price $3.99. So I got it for $2. I thought that'd be really cute for wreath making and everything. And it's just wired. So it'll be really easy to make a couple things. I've got a couple ideas in mind for that. I saw a YouTube video from Missy and I will link her channel below. I'm trying to think it's like Cove, Crafty Cove DIY, Cove DIY. I'm sorry, Missy, if you watch this. I'll link it below for you though. She just did a DIY with like a little reef on a house. I thought it was really cute. Pumpkins, they're like these really pretty soft velvet and they've got the cream and they've got this gorgeous green and some pine cones. Original price was $7.99. It's a little on the expensive side, but the pumpkins looked really nice, so. They're 40% off on their fall stuff right now. So I was like, you know what? It's like the only thing that I'm buying that's not 50 to 75% off. I can, I can have to live with it. All right, so on to my bigger items. This one original price was $29.99. I got it 75% off. I was like, you know what? That's a steal. And it says together is my favorite place to be. I'll be really honest. I'm going to get rid of that. Um, I'm either going to sand this off. I'll probably try to sand it and maybe do like a paint and then sand it down. Because I wish, I don't know, we'll see what I end up doing if I do something else to cover that up. But it's got like the two soft tooth hangers in the back. I love the faux wood grain. It's not, it's not real. It is an MDF board, right? Yes, it is an MDF board. So but it's super pretty, it's huge. Can you imagine this? Sorry, I can't even get around it. It's like, hello. Um, <laughs> can you imagine this is like a welcome sign over by your front door or doing something like a general store sign on this for your kitchen or pantry or something like that? Beautiful, beautiful, love it. I don't know what I'm doing it with it yet, but I had to. I keep buying all of these big pieces because I'm like well it's a good deal I'm gonna make something with them and now I'm like I don't know where I'm gonna put it <laughs> oh well worst problems to have right all right so I've got this really nice long again MDF but original price was $14.99 I got it 75% off and just says stay a while it's really pretty um who knows maybe this will stay this way I don't know maybe not we'll see Again, I just liked the look of it. I thought it would be, even if you just wanted to do home on it, it'd be really pretty. And, you know, a little bit nicer than like making, you can obviously make your own with Dollar Tree stuff that are those longer, you know, boards, but it's a little sturdier, it's a little straighter. You know, those ones, you get them and they're a little wonky. Already framed for you, just easy as can be. 
Now these ones were a bit of a splurge because they were they were during the, when it was 66% off. They did not have a tag, so I asked them to oh they're backward. The one's backwards. Oh, I have them the wrong side. You get the idea. It's like this. Um but they were buying you had to buy each one of them. They weren't a set, which I don't get because I was like, well, I don't know. Would would somebody do that? Would somebody buy just one window? You guys all have to let me know in the comments. Do, do you think someone would buy just one of these? I was like, how? I don't know. I can't imagine doing just one of them. But then again, I shop a lot. So I'm like, nope, two. You definitely need two of those. Anyways, they did not have a price tag. They couldn't find them online. So they said right, to do it as a regular price was $20. So on sale, I got it for like six and change. And I thought, you know what? $12 for the two of them is not bad. I will take it. And then last one is a tear tray. I have made a couple here and there. They're never as good as I want them to be though. You know, like what they would be if you bought them. Original price on this guy was $40 and I got him at the 66% off. So kind of on the pricey side, but I was like, you know what? It's not bad. I'll probably DIY this to be honest because I don't do a ton of just the galvanized stuff. Like I'll whitewash it then like leave some of it galvanized or distress it down or something to that effect. This like middle one is like wiggling and it's definitely not level. Hmm. We'll have to see what I can do to fix it. Maybe it just needs to be screwed in a little bit more, but I figured it was worth it. But I think that is all that I picked up at least in this little Hobby Lobby, well, little, not so little Hobby Lobby trips. There were two of them. I mean, it like literally didn't even take all of it out of the back of the car on the first trip until after the second trip happened. Uh, but I saw that they had their sale going and I just had to go. It's like that Monday morning, I was like out the door, ready to get there as soon as they opened. Because I was like, you know what? I want the best pick I can get of the stuff that's on sale. So that is my haul today though. Don't forget to check back here. Uh, I will eventually... As soon as I can get my husband to pull all of the stuff out of our attic space, attic is probably a very loose interpretation of that word. I live in central Florida, so our attic isn't really an attic. It's just like a space that the people who had the house before us kind of built out a little bit where it has like an actual floor, well, plywood, you know, floor. But we have our stuff up there and I need to get him to pull that down so I can start decorating for fall and he loves fall too. My husband loves fall, so he'll be happy to get the fall stuff down for me, I think. They don't love that I don't do traditional fall decor, like colors and stuff, but they get over it. I, I, I sprinkle it in too, so they don't have just like blue and green. They're like, those aren't the right colors. My, my kids got all upset about it last year. They're like, that's not the right color for fall, mom. Like, well, excuse me. Um, I'm rambling now. So don't forget to check out my DIY channel. I'll have it linked for you below to kind of see what I do with everything. Like I said, some of it will probably stay the way it is, but definitely not all of it. And I can't wait to show you guys what I have in store for Friday over on my DIY channel. I can't wait for you to see it. Make sure you go over there, check it out, and I will see you next time. Bye.